so we're right now in full auto mode um, and going about 26 mile an hour and we're just coming away right at 1500 rpm and uh, so yeah it's not real exciting but we'll just slow her back here real quick this is for home you can see it just kind of brings the rpms right up to slow us down and just like that Even though this is already cleared off, you don't have to actually do anything in the driveway here. But yeah, normally when I run this thing, I just kind of float her so she kind of can move up and down a little bit as we as we go through the driveway here. And not uh, any uh, imperfections; it just kind of goes up or down. So that's pretty nice to have. I mean, all the all your loaders you can have that, but or almost all of them anyway. But just yeah, this makes it pretty easy. I hate these trees. Well, I like them, but it's real hard with the loader on here. I'm trying to scoop snow. So we actually already broke the emblem off. Fold them, keep folding the mirrors back, have to keep those things tucked in pretty good. All that fun jazz, but oh yeah, we'll just kind of go through the yard here real quick and then call her a day. Slow back just a little bit. Yeah, we're still in two wheel drive. Pop it in the four wheel drive real quick. Not that it's pushing that hard anyway today. Yeah, and this loader has always had pretty good visibility. Um, you can see right down to your to the corner bucket of the buckets pretty well most of the time. It's not always a hundred percent, but pretty good. reverser obviously um, so just like that and uh, one of the things oh I forgot how fast we're going now that was gonna be one of the things I was gonna say I like it's also gonna be a little scary but with these IBTs you have really fast reverse speeds which if you've got so you can actually I can't until I'm in park or neutral at least um, change this to pedal but if you you got your pedal right there and so it just runs just like a car but you can set that speed here I'll show you real quick all right so you can go hit pedal and that's gonna obviously bump my throttle all the way up because it's a manual this is manual the th your throttles manual we operated in pedal um, so I don't really just for like loader work I just run like 11 1200 rpm is all um, but yeah once you're in pedal you can still set your speeds um, your whoops brakes real quick but you can hold you can set that to wherever and then just yeah, well you set that all the way forward barely is going You're just creeping along here you can see and then all I gotta do is just speed up hit the throttle and it's just real slick. I like that a lot. Um, 
you got good visibility out the back too. But what I was gonna say is that reverse speed is quite fast, which is a really big deal um, when it comes time to do some loader work, especially if you have you know long distance to go in, in a reverse. Um, we always used to run. This is. It's kind of funny, but this is a replacement for an old 2510 with a farm hand on it. Actually, that's the farm hand bucket right there. Um, you can see that. But yeah, that had a four speed forward. Oops, hard to get that on there. Four speed reverse is all it had, and it just wasn't that all that fast. But yeah, this is a whole lot faster and it really seems to work pretty well. We actually ended up tilling with that 4630 this fall instead of this tractor. Um, just a little bit this spring. Run that baler with this as well. Um, but oh yeah, seems to work. Seems to work pretty well. Also field cultivator, chisel, kind of whatever. It all seems to work. Work pretty reasonable in either that tractor there or this tractor. They're pretty, pretty similar. Um, my dad, I think he likes the older tractor a little bit better. Seems like it. He's got more control with it. Um, not that you can't control this. You know, you throw that thing in in manual, and it's pretty, pretty self-explanatory. But at the same time, this one kind of has a few frills that you kind of have to watch for but really do like the tractor overall so far so and it's pretty quiet so all right well thought i'd uh make a quick video for you guys so see you later